Hello, beloved listeners. Let's get to it. The cosmic energy is lit up with an activation that can make us feel anxious. But in reality, it's the immensity of the new energy coming in with Aries season. So today, we're diving into the profound energy shift heralded by the arrival of Aries season under the emperor. We'll tap into a powerful visualization along with actionable journaling questions to cultivate and use this energy of the forthcoming spring season, guided by the wisdom of the emperor. If you're new to tarot, I dive into the divinatory power of integrating tarot into our daily lives, enriching our connection to the universe's rhythms. As we bid adieu to the quietude of winter, the vernal equinox marks the beginning of a cosmic new year bash. Your guides are sharing that it's time to leave behind the dreamy vibe where we get caught floating in imagination and spinning our wheels. With the arrival of Aries season, it's all about igniting the fire within that's likely been dimmed for quite some time. You get to choose to say dormant or to get lit up with the season of Aries, which is the bringer of the fire element as a spark that sets the zodiac wheel ablaze. Now let's reflect on the nature of healing and transformation. Genuine healing doesn't come with shortcuts. It demands we dive deep into our feelings and physical sensations, moving from the mind's chatter to the heart's fiery embrace. That's where true change begins. With this backdrop, let's focus on the purpose of our dialogue today. Let's turn our gaze toward the emperor, inviting us to tap into our inner muse and light up our creative essence with his guidance. Envision yourself harnessing your gut driven revelations and grand visions, using them as fuel to sustain your artistic fire. The emperor, with his sage wisdom, encourages us to ignite our passions while also equipping ourselves with the resilience to face what lies ahead. As someone deeply connected to the tarot, I find the fiery essence of Aries and the dynamic energy of the wands suit to be particularly inspiring. Both Aries and the wands thrive in the element of fire, reminding us of the transformative power of energy and enthusiasm. In the emperor card, we see a figure of authority seated firmly on his throne, embodying leadership and a readiness to take action. The emperor symbolizes hard work, industry, and the accumulation of experience. He offers a model for us to aspire to, encouraging us to hone our skills in preparation for the day we can embody such leadership ourselves. Now let's delve into the symbolic aspects of the emperor card. In his right hand, he holds an ankh, the Egyptian symbol of life, representing the balance of masculine and feminine energies, life and creation. His left hand grips a golden apple or sphere, a potent symbol of power. The emperor's throne, in stark contrast to the empress's lush surroundings, symbolizes his impartiality reinforcing the symbolism of authority and leadership. Behind the emperor, the Rocky Mountains signify the challenges that lie ahead, as well as his unshakable resolve to face them. The river that flows behind his throne offers a juxtaposition, hinting at the potential for growth and renewal amidst adversity, and reminding us of the emperor's depth and underlying sensuality. His attire, a red robe and armor, signify his passion, virtue, and readiness for battle. Yet, the presence of the river suggests a heart filled with depth and sensitivity beneath his armor. The emperor's crown, unlike more traditional crowns, is closed, symbolizing self-sufficiency, self-reliance, and the intrinsic power to lead. In embracing the upright emperor, we recognize our own potential for leadership. As we conclude our journey, I invite you to engage in expansion journaling. You can grab the example questions in the blog as you reflect on the emperor and considering the emotions, desires, and questions they evoke within you. Use fire as a creative tool, allowing the element of fire to transform your work. Draw inspiration from the suit of wands, letting the energy of the tarot guide your creative endeavors. That's a wrap. We'll connect again soon and remember to not rush through this exercise. And in the meantime, head to the end of this blog and grab the free personal flow operating system and flow archetype so you can instantly gain clarity on your instinctive strengths and stay focused on what really matters 
and lights up your entrepreneurial spirit.